Today's actually a pretty cool day, pretty cool fishing video today, guys, because my oldest son is with me. Um, I haven't done a video with any of my kids. I have taken my kids fishing, my kids do fish, but um, it's like just an all day guided trip on Clear Lake, trying to catch catfish and bass with um, Zach Ploger, uh, I think his YouTube um, username is Live Bass Movement, so check him out. I've been using him for a while just for got it trips with buddies and hopefully go and um, just put a hurting on him on Clear Lake and have a great time and uh, hopefully he catches his PB today. That'd be awesome. So anyway, come along. We're going to have a great time. <laughs> Jacoby ready to go. Got him on a GoPro. Uh, we're loaded up in Zach's apparently new Skeeter here. This thing's pretty sweet. We got a bunch of new gen guys out here today. Uh, they got their TOC over the weekend. So um, should be fun though. No wind and uh, we are uh, getting ready to roll out. Let's go. You're gonna hold it like this, right? What? Your pinky finger? Back here, okay. you know, holding the real between that pinky finger and those feet, right? Um, all right. Keep throwing in this pocket right here. Keep doing that exact same thing you just did. Right, I'll try a little whopper plopper or something yeah, like yeah, that. The top one. They will come up on top water. It's kind of it's rare, but it's a big one. Usually they're doing it. I'll tell you if you're doing it wrong. You're doing great. Yeah. You want to put this on? Sure. Yeah, so we're actually going to run now. Not far, but we are going to run. I had to try it really fast. I thought we might be able to pick one off with a flash right in my pocket. All right, here, we'll, we'll wait until we get to the next one. You're going to have to take your hat off. Take off the. This? Yeah, just for a second, and then we'll yeah. put this on underneath. Yep. Put that arm through. Yeah, that around. Click it in there. Push it in. There you go. And then turn it on. That uh, frog bite ever end up turning on here? A little bit. Evening. Kind of have to be out here like late, late, like as the sun's going down and throwing a black frog slow. You get, you get frog fish. So yeah. It's just kind of funny how like it's just not really, it's not a normal through like frog bite. Yeah. There you go. Yep. You got one. Oh, God. Right around. Right around. There you go. Yep. Keep me on. 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 Walk a little bit closer. There you go. Feel them all right. Yeah. Yeah. That's a good one to start right, right there. Let's go. <laughs> High five. Yeah. Love it. Chris, get my phone so you can take oh, a picture. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Oh dude, that's a good one for the first fish of the day, bud. You gotta know hold them, right? Yeah. There you go, hold them tight. There you go. One, two, three. Awesome, dude. Cool. Mm -hmm. Get a picture of your dad. Yeah, all right, you ready? One, two, three. There you go. Awesome. All right, Sweet, dude. Okay. 
you guys like it caked up with algae, right? Right. Something natural. It's weird. There we go. Oh, there you go. Nice. Sure, freight train that one. Oh yeah. Nice. About the same? Nice. Awesome. Get a picture and throw them in the live well. Okay, you're good, you're good. Let me just get it down. There we go. Alright. Free real quick. Little guy, but little guy, fish. little chatterbait fish. We'll, we'll take him. We'll toss him back. Yeah, small one. We'll, should be able to get bigger ones than that. But hey, I'll take a chatterbait fish. That's yeah. The really? Well, then that's definitely over your feet. Okay. Yeah. down the wall parallel with the chatterbait and stuff. <laughs> oh. oh. It broke the leader or what? Broke the oh, chat chatterbait. Yeah. That guy smoked it. Yeah, I was gonna say. Throw in there. Dang it. <laughs> that was a, that was a, yeah, I can see. Look at this. I should have checked that. That was all frayed up. Yeah. Yeah. That's my fault for not checking that. It happens. Fish will start to congregate. Actually, school a little bit more on spots that. Kind of like what we're fishing today, like that one we broke off back there. Right. That little pocket, I had a four pounder there a couple days ago. Okay. That exact spot damn near, like within 20 yards of it, right? Right. So what will happen is, instead of a couple days going by for it to reload, there will like always be a residual fish up there, one or two, right? Okay. But you'll look out with live and you'll see like off the break, or maybe there's They're all sitting out there? out there? There'll be like 10 of them sitting out there. Okay. And then you can try to catch those ones. Yeah, you might be able to get one or two, but kind of hard to get them right right but you'll come back like at 11 o'clock or noon or during that bite window and I'll just... you go up and look up there and they won't be out off the front anymore and you like pan up towards where you caught that residual one this morning or that morning right and you look and there's 10 of them up there they're now. just sitting up there so your square bill your chatter yeah and then it's just bam 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 you know you whack them. nice but and that's how that's the best days i've had in the fall or like that when you can time up schools right of, of fish There you go, buddy. Oh, yeah. Dude, high five. That's two really nice fish today for you. Nice, dude. Look at that one. That's got to be close to five. Maybe four. Let's go. So it does have some... Yeah, it's kind of mangy, but... Uh, it's a mangy one. It's a mangy one. So don't touch any of that. Definitely hold them up for a picture because that, that is a tank. I got it. Okay. Ready? One, two, three. Awesome. Nice, dude. That's, well. that's a good one. That's a good one right there. <laughs> On the spinning rod makes it more interesting. Oh, dude, I was panicking a little bit there. I thought I was going to get him in that brush. I got it caught on the tree and then I fell down. As soon as it fell down. Yep. That that's the way they do it. One? That's the biggest one so far. Biggest one so far. It's got to be four pounds. All right. 
I'm not gonna feel bad anymore about catching fish. Oh no, he's got he's got a little competition going now. He's got the two biggest I think so far. I think he does, yeah. I'm gonna retie after that one though. I don't know, that one I broke off was probably not. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's what I, that's what I gotta tell myself. No, I, I'm you know I'm not even, I'm not even gonna lie. That's all. It, that was a good one. It was a good one. A ten pounder. You call those once in a lifetime fish for a lot of people, right? A titan. A titan. Oh, oh here we go. Yeah. Yay. Oh, that's a little guy. It's all good. But there's two fish in the same spot. That guy smoked like it. That means we got to here. Oh yeah. Get him up. Nice. Little guy. Chris is on him. I'm on him. <laughs> no doubt about it. Do a picture real quick, just because. <laughs> just because it's the same spot. Oh, can we get Jacoby to hold this? I mean. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> got it. How much have we caught? So three no. that we have Four. in the wild. Four or five. Line. That'd be the yeah, fifth we one. Five. And then we lost one, right? Yeah. Yeah, because you caught that other one, we would put it in the live well. Yeah. You get a little tick there. Oh yeah. Oh. <laughs> like I felt something. <laughs> this guy. This oh, guy. Yeah. All right. Again. Is he big enough? Oh yeah, we'll, we'll put him in the line. Well. Shoot, yeah, I need to have one. For, I, I need to have one for me to hold today. Can you get it on my phone too? Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm on it. He's catching them all day, and then that one person who wasn't catching them finally sticks the right one. That's all right, I think when I went out here with your mom, I think she kicked oh, my butt too. Oh, dude, it's hilarious. That yeah, like you were on a spinning rod. Different. She was just, oh no, she was doing that weird like, She was doing this. Thing. She was doing like this circle motion. Yep. I was like, you gotta be kidding me. I just remember because we were talking about it. As she was we were talking about it, she was doing it and she got bit. Yeah. What the hell? What was she doing? She was, had doing. a spinning rod, but <laughs> she would just... Because you've been doing the same thing. He's just kind of just, just hopping in along. Yeah. Flared up like it looked like a neck. Oh yeah, you see how it's stuck now? Look what you gotta do. You ready? Because what happens is the line underneath takes those loops. You see those loops right there? Kind of look like. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah, it's a good one. Oh, it's not that big, but hey, I'll take it. I'll he take gave it. me the freaking ride, dude. <laughs> Golly. Get a picture. Get a picture. Take a picture of that. Fun eat, though. God dang. Slam it. Oh, yeah. One, two, three. Got it. Cool. And yeah, we'll toss it back. I toss it back. One better. Alright, Flo's showing you how to bird. Alright everybody, uh, I didn't do an intro video or outro video on the water, so I'll do one now on the way home safely. Uh, overall, you know, recap of the day, uh, caught fish, you know, I think we caught 10 between us, maybe more. A slower day definitely for the fall. Uh, I think it was like 90 degrees today or something like that. No wind. It was definitely a little bit warm and grind today. We had to move around a lot to find them. Uh, after
afternoon bite really wasn't there that day, but you know the main main ones were uh, a flashy swimmer with a Kitek, a white chatterbait with a Kitek, um, or a Zeko trailer, and then the swim jig. So uh, biggest fish of the day was Jacoby's uh, four five. Cut that on a flashy swimmer uh, just up in the buck brush. Most of my bites were right off the, uh, the weed line, right off the buck brush line, right off the tooling line. So, you know, overall, it's we still caught fish. It wasn't like it was wide, wide open. Uh, we had like a 90 degree day today, so it was a warming trend in the middle of fall, which is really not what you want. Um, you want uh, those colder nights, uh, you know, moderate days. It's the opposite of what you want in spring. You don't want a warming trend in fall. Um, but you know what? We still caught fish. We still had a good time. Um, Kobe caught his PB twice. So um, looks like the new gen's got their guys coming out for the TOC this weekend. So good luck to everybody fishing the new gen tournament. And uh, you know, as always, thank you guys for watching. Thanks for uh, hitting that like and subscribe button if you haven't already. Do that, and uh, we will catch you guys on the next one. See you. Got it by the tail, I'm dropping in.